In two weeks, the COVID-19 public health emergency will end. States are now preparing to move forward from the pandemic after three long years. It's been over two months since new COVID-19 cases in Virginia topped 1,000. New at six, Dan Kennedy takes a final look at hospitalizations in the Commonwealth. This is the Virginia Hospital and Healthcare Association COVID-19 dashboard. It was launched in April 2020 and provided daily updates during the last three years of the pandemic. It told us how many people were in the hospital with COVID and what kind of burden that placed on overworked nurses and doctors. We would then use those numbers to build these charts to put it all in perspective for you. When things were really bad, we would give these reports on a nightly basis, but that is no longer the case. This is where things stand today. Just 135 people statewide hospitalized with COVID-19, and that is a record low, all pandemic officially as of today. Hospitalizations peaked in January of last year with 3,790 patients back then, and no doubt we have come a long way. And tonight is the last update we'll get from VHHA. This dashboard is shutting down for two reasons, they say. The relatively few number of people fighting COVID in the hospital and the federal COVID-19 public health emergency officially ends two weeks from today. Dan Kennedy, 13 News Now.